Good morning, I look like a little egg today. It's actually not morning for me, it is almost two o'clock. I've been working as usual. I've got so much done this morning, but I am heading to Starbucks today. I've said it for the last three days, I haven't been, but I need to go today because I need some more shopping. And there's a Starbucks that is literally right opposite Tesco, which is where I've been getting my amazing strawberries from. So I thought I could kill two birds with one stone and go to Tesco and go to Starbucks at the same time. So I'm just gonna like pack my bag and head there. I have so much to do at the minute. It's actually ridiculous, but I'm enjoying it because obviously I took like 10 days off. It's just so nice to actually be doing stuff again, but I do feel very like overwhelmed. I have a lot of stuff to do. I got a H&M order. Oh my God, I've just remembered what I've got. I want to save this stuff to do a big homeware haul, but I got some of these spotty towels. This like dotty print is really in at the minute and I want a monochrome bathroom. So I've got some of those. I got four big ones, I think and then four little ones to use as like hand towels. And I've got some pastel pink plain towels to like mix in with these. Oh my God, I got a swimming costume. I got loads of makeup stuff because I want to do a testing H&M makeup. One thing that I absolutely love is this gold tray. It was a bit more expensive. I think it was like 17 pounds, but it's humongous and it's obviously got the handles on. And in my new house, I'm not having a coffee table. I basically just want a sofa with an ottoman to put your feet up on because my coffee table just gets so cluttered I never put anything on there that like needs to be on there I feel like sometimes coffee tables are just so irrelevant so what I'm doing instead is I'm just having a couple of side tables like this I've got a side table for this one but I'm just gonna have like a couple of little side tables I'm not having these sofas by the way but yeah I'm gonna sell these two coffee tables and just get a big ottoman so that everybody on the sofa can put the feet up because right now I only have a long bit on the pink one and it's always me that sits there and I always feel bad when people are here in case they want to put the feet up and they can't so that is like my plan with the new place but I do kind of want to use the ottoman as, as a coffee table as well I've seen people do this where they just like put a tray on the ottoman so I've bought that for that reason it could just like take it into the kitchen, get a few drinks on it and put them on the ottoman and yeah, just thought that would be quite cute. So that is one of the main purchases that I got from H&M. I'm gonna sort this out when I get back, I think, but I love these towels. Oh my gosh, look how cute these are. I also got these earrings. They're so cute, I love them. And look how good all this, all this makeup looks. I can't wait to do a video with all of this. I also got some new salt and pepper shakers. Shall I show you them? These are the tackiest thing that I own, but I weirdly love them. My kitchen is gonna be so plain and I just think it'll look like you know when people have like just weird things around the house and you're like oh that's actually quite cool because it's so not normal well these are going to be that part of my kitchen <laughs> i think they're so cute the little cheetahs these might be my new favorite earrings obviously not with this outfit and not with my hair like this but how cute are these i love them <laughs> feel like a lampshade <laughs> Woo. oh my gosh guys some flooring samples came for my new house I want a white wooden floor and I'm really leaning towards this one in the middle. These ones just seem way too grey. But yeah, I really like this one in the middle. It's from UK Flooring Direct and it's the white oak laminate flooring. And I want it throughout my whole house. I just feel like this one would look really cool. It'd go with everything. Like this would be the floor that has to go in my kitchen, my living room, my bedrooms. Yeah, I like that one a lot. Let me know what you think. I bet a lot of you will probably like the grey ones, but grey is just not for me with my furniture style and stuff i definitely need some sort of white one and that's the best one that i've come across so far so yeah I'm really excited about that i've just got dressed and i literally look like i'm going for a run i have another one of these tops on from marks and spencers and they have like hand holes in so i just always look like i'm about to do something really sporty and then if you open this it's got a neon yellow collar i think it's so cool but yeah, I'm just going to shove my huge Parker coat on and head off now. What time is it? 19 minutes past two. I want to get home probably at about five. It's been four weeks since you called and I've been waiting here for you all along. 
I've been waiting here for you all along. Where you been? Where did you go? I wonder if you found what you're looking for. Starbucks was literally so full, and as soon as I went in, a woman sat in like the only spare seat. So I've just come to a little park. Yeah, I can't really work here, so I'm just gonna have to go back home. But it's such a nice day. Can you tell? I feel like kind of anxious right now, but it's cool. Hello everybody, it's 10 to 9 and I'm considering going to the co-op because I really want a chicken wrap tomorrow and I have personal training at kind of like lunch time so I either have to go in the morning or I have to go now to get some chicken and some wraps and some lettuce. It's nice and grizzly outside. I'm like the only person on YouTube who actually likes shit weather. <laughs> Basically on Friday, I'm meeting Lucy in London and we've decided we're just taking the day to work together. So I don't wanna edit too many of my videos because then I'll have nothing to do. So I've kind of just taken this evening to just chill and I'm so bored. <laughs> I'm literally so bored. I've also been watching Seven Year Switch, but the Australian one. I didn't watch season one, I just started on season two. And in the last few days, I've managed to get to episode eight of that. So I've been watching that, but I've literally been in bed since like five o'clock and I'm just very, very bored. So I think if I go to the co-op, it'll wake me up a little bit. This is where my little nugget is sat. You've been having a nice sleepy time, haven't you? <laughs> Look at him, he gets so cozy on this bed. He loves it. The last couple of vlogs have been so boring. I'm really sorry. But the next vlog, I'll probably put Thursday and Friday Fridays together just to kind of get back on track because I'm kind of behind with my vlogs. I'll be seeing Lucy on Friday so that'll be a bit more of a fun vlog. Then my mum comes back on Saturday because I'm going back to Sheffield on Monday and I'm going to view my house with a builder so that he can see what needs to be done to it because there's a couple of walls that need knocking down and I need a whole new floor across the entire place. I need a new ceiling in the living room. I need a new kitchen. There is quite a lot to be done so I'm taking a builder and he's said if everything goes through like if I get my keys in the next couple of weeks he can start work on it at the end of April which would be incredible if you didn't know I move in in July have I had this chat in this vlog I feel like I have but my rent here is up on the 22nd of July so I'll probably be moving into my new house like a week or two before that so obviously I want all the work done before I move in so it would be so perfect if he could start work at the end of April I'm just like praying I get my keys soon which I think I do like everything's going so to plan it's currently the 14th of March so I could own a house this month if not like the start of April how amazing would that be I'm so excited but on Saturday as well mum and I are gonna go to B&Q and get some custom paint mixed to redecorate her room and also I'm getting a paint for my new flat I want this specific gold shade and you might be like oh gold on the walls but I'm not having it all the way up the walls I want like this shade here so it's not a really garish gold but I want it in like my dressing room area and I only want it halfway up the wall so like on the bottom half and then I'm obviously I'm gonna have my dressing table a big mirror on the wall a big full-length mirror as well and I'm gonna have like lots of shelves and stuff with my bags on and shoes and everything I've got a vision but I want a really specific shade of gold that's not like yellow gold so I also want to try and get that color mixed as well so Friday and Saturday should be quite fun days which is very exciting isn't it smells in my goosey pants. <laughs> hey, you've been loving a snuggle, haven't you? Oh, pop it. I'm getting up, which means that you'll get up, so I'm sorry for disturbing your cuddly time, but you're so attached to your mummy that you have to go everywhere she goes. Ain't that right? waiting for my video to upload and it is finally done so i'm gonna head to the co-op now it's 20 past nine god i'm risking it going out at this time <laughs> oh look at me i am a blessing to the world i literally hey let's go going out without my lip balm risky i always get dead nervous to go out at this time i'm such a wimp i've got you guys to keep me company i'm scared <laughs> weird though guys because this time of day is also my absolute favorite i love it so much because it's like cold 
but not too cold and it's just nice there's barely anybody about i really like it i look like a right wally in my pajamas <laughs> Oh my god, all the shelves in there. That's what I want. And I'm back in the lift with my shopping. Good. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> morning everybody i am ready to work out as you can see i'm literally just about to leave and go to training i am going at oh my god what time is it oh my god i've still got literally half an hour i've timed this so wrong my training is at two today and it's quarter past one and i have to leave like 15 minutes before to get there and i well thought that if i left now i would get there at two but I would get there at half one. Such an idiot. So yeah, you've got me for half an hour. Woo! I'm feeling so much better from my period. My period made me put on six pounds. How insane is that? Pure bloat. My stomach was like, and I can always tell in my legs when they're retaining water and stuff. And I've dropped that now pretty much. I've got two pounds to go, but I'm still bloated. Like my period does this to me all the time. Let me know if you're the same. I will literally put on half a stone and then it'll just go. It's so frustrating. I just had a pretty chill one yesterday. I literally laid in bed and watched telly for ages because I just don't want to get too much work done before I go to London tomorrow because I'm literally going to London to work with Lucy in a cafe. And if I get all my work done now, I have nothing to do then so i'm like rationing my work but i did edit vlogs and stuff because i'm still behind on my blooming vlogs don't know how that happened i may as well tidy the kitchen while i've got time let's do that do you really know about trust it could hurt my love, y'all, but you really got the choice, but have some. We all fall down, never getting used to feeling numb. It's getting hard to overcome some knowledge to be free from this gun. One shot, and I'm down. Oh, I know that all is gonna fall, never learn from it all. Like a fastball in motion, I'm open. I thought that we had it all, now I'm broken and scarred And I'm scared of it all, no joking Oh, no joking Oh, I thought that we had it all, now I'm broken and scarred And I'm scared of it all, oh, no joking a little bit better isn't it no more stuff on the side my kitchen side is so cluttered <laughs> i've got so many machines and stuff freaking love my juicer best thing i own never use my kitchen aid but it looks pretty i use this all the time it's way better than a nutribullet in my eyes it's a breville blender and it comes with these cups so you like attach that to the bottom of the cup and then once you're done it comes with lids so you can take them with you so you literally don't have to wash anything other than the cup you don't have like five things to wash but yeah that is my kitchen now looking a bit better but then we get to that side and i haven't done that side yet that has taken me a good 20 minutes <laughs> i'm so slow i did the dishwasher as well though yeah now it's time for me to go so i'm gonna head off to training i'll talk to you when i'm back it looks so sunny today look at the blue sky how gorgeous is that this is my kitchen view beautiful i don't think i've shown you guys this but look how lovely this is it's just a marble slab it was from i think debenhams and it's by jasper conran it's a little bit stained right now because i left some stuff on it but in my new house i'm having a marble countertop so this will just like blend in it won't look like there's an actual chopping board on my countertop it should just like blend in perfectly so yeah my mum actually bought me this which i'm so grateful for i love it i've got my water and I'm off. Why do you sit on plastic bags? You're a weirdo.